everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I am very excited because I am gonna be reviewing the Body Shop's new Pumpkin Instant Radiance in Shower Face Mask. So I have no makeup on for that very reason because I'm gonna be applying the product. I thought maybe I could put makeup on and film bits where I'm discussing the product and then have no makeup on to actually try it on. But then I thought, do you know what? I'm just gonna film this video without makeup on because I cannot be bothered to do it today. So, here is the mask. Now, I first of all was scrolling through my Instagram stories and then one of my friends that does the body shop at home, she posted about it like launching in a few days and I was like, oh my God, like I want that because I'm a massive face mask lover. I wear them every single day. I even have done a video on my channel where I simply review all of the face masks that I've tried from the body shop, which is quite a lot. So I will link that down below. And somebody did also comment on that video asking if I can film a review of this product. So here I am. I purchased it on the day it was launched. I was so excited to get hold of it. I will link down the um, girl's Instagram that I got this from because she's very nice and it came very quickly and she gave me a discount as well, which was really nice of her. So I will leave her Instagram linked in the description if you wanna go and check her out. So I picked this little guy up. I did also get a few other bits too, but I discussed that in the weekly vlog that you will have just seen that's gone up a couple of days ago. So if you haven't watched that, go and watch it. But let's get cracking with the review. I'm gonna pop my little headband on, of course. My skin is nice and clean, no products are on my skin whatsoever. This is just what it looks like after I've washed it. So, got my face mask on, got my hair, got my headband on, don't know what I'm on about. I first of all love the packaging of this. I think it is going to be one of their like core products now that they just keep. I don't think it's out just for autumn, but please correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, I do love the packaging of this. I think it's going to be like the addition to their expert face mask collection. And it says to apply this product onto dry skin, leave it on for five minutes while showering and remove with water and that you can use it twice a week. So I will certainly be using this twice a week. I get excited to use this. I have already used it twice since I bought it, which was probably a week ago. I can't really tell you about like the long-term effects of it, but I just want to get this video up because I'm excited. Um, but but now the only thing that I thought about this was that I'm not sure on the whole in the shower situation. So when it says like, put it on for five minutes whilst you're in the shower and then wash it off. I personally uh, like to keep a face mask on for a little bit longer than that. So I put it on out of the shower um, for about 10 minutes. I'll leave it on for about 10 minutes and then I go into the shower. Now I did use it doing what it stated on here and it doesn't really kind of set on the skin because the shower's going, the steam from the shower does not like set down the mask, which is probably what that is meant to do anyway. And it is quite like a hydrating mask, whereas I kind of prefer them to just set down a little bit. And what I found is that when I don't use this in the shower, it does set a little bit, almost like a clay mask slightly. And I quite like that. And then after 10 minutes, I will wash it off and it leaves your skin really soft. I'll talk about the benefits of it whilst I've got it on my face, but it's got this little guy to keep it nice and fresh. This is what it looks like on the inside. So it's like um, very much a pumpkin-y colour and it's got like little black things in which are almost like the pumpkin seeds. It's cute. Smells like pumpkins. It almost smells like a pumpkin spice latte without all the extra kind of spices that they add in but it does definitely smell like a pumpkin and the texture of it is really nice. It's kind of like a thick texture. So I'm gonna to start to pop it on my face. Now you can use your, um, like a face mask brush or if you me, you'll just use your hands. So I just use my hands to apply this because I feel like when I used a brush, because I did use a brush with this the first time, I applied too much product. And you don't need, you know, excessive amounts of product when you are applying, um, you know, skincare in general. So yeah, I'm just gonna pop this on, but it does glide onto the skin really easily and really nicely. And yeah, it makes you look like a pumpkin. So um, Halloween costume sorted. Of something in there. I'm not sure what that is. I'll put it on my face. It's like a 
is that a chunk of pumpkin? I don't know. Kind of weird. The main texture of this is quite smooth, so it's kind of weird to come across that. Oh my god, what was that? Did you see that? Something's hanging off my eyeball. Did it go in my hair? I don't know what that was. Um, but yeah, it's kind of hard for me to see what I'm doing. But yeah, can you see that here? That's like a random chunk of something. I'm worried, but yeah, it must be okay because it's in the mask and I trust, I trust the body shop. Oh, my nose. I was like, something's missing. Right, I think I've pretty much applied that everywhere. It's hard for me to see on camera, but yeah, I think I have. First impressions of this product when I did first use it was that it was very smooth to apply and it did glide onto the skin really nicely and it felt quite nice on the skin, like it didn't irritate my skin or anything, but then most products don't irritate my skin anyway. And yeah, it just feels like quite cooling on the skin if anything, it's nice. I like the look of it because it does make you look like a pumpkin, which is very fitting for um, like autumn months, especially October. So this will be great um, for then. Oh, sorry, I've just realized I've accidentally got this everywhere. By the way, sorry about the sun. It just decides to come out really bright in my eyes. So thanks for that. The benefits and the kind of disadvantages of this product that I've kind of come across just by using it literally two times and then this third time. Um, benefits wise, my skin feels really soft after I've used the product. So it is definitely like a radiance product as it says, which is very, very good. And another benefit that I found that I like is the color and how it looks on the skin when you're doing it. I like face masks to be quite fun to use in a way and I think this is quite a fun product to use. I also really like the smell of it, I like the texture of it apart from this random pumpkin thing, I don't know. And yeah, I think it's a really nice face mask in general. I feel like it is kind of a perfect face mask to use in the shower because it is um, the kind of thing that is very glowy and when you remove it with water, it doesn't remove straight away. So for me, I feel like you have to kind of scrub at it a little bit to get it off because it is so like moisturizing that you, it's almost like rubbing off a moisturizer with water. It's not like the easiest thing. So I feel like in the shower, that will be easier than if you didn't go in the shower. But like I said, this is meant for in the shower, so maybe you should do that. But me personally, I'm here to break the rules when it comes to face masks, and I'm not gonna do that today in this video. I might get a bowl of water and actually show you me washing off uh, of my face like here because it's really hard for me to film it in my bathroom. But yeah, so this is what it's looking like on my skin. Apologies for the sunshine. Closing my eyes because it hurts. Um, but I think that looks quite nice on the skin and um, yeah, the only disadvantage I could find from this was the fact that it does take a little while to kind of like rub off your skin, but that's not an issue. It really doesn't take that long and um, yeah, I got it on my hands. Um, but yeah, I really like this product and I would recommend it. I will um, leave this on for another five minutes. I will check back in with you what it's looking like after that five minutes, which will probably be about a total of 10 minutes with this product on my face and then we'll wash it off and I'll give you my overall thoughts and whether I would recommend this product. Okay, so I am now back. It has been about 10 minutes ish, probably a bit less. Um, it has set down on my skin a little bit. I know that if I leave it on for about 10, 15 minutes, it does kind of look a little bit more matte, which means that it's set down a little bit more. I'm not sure if there's like any clay in that or anything like that that makes it set down. But um, this is what it's looking like. So pretty much the same, to be honest. Oh, damn it, I need a hair tie because I'm gonna do that. Maybe if I put my hair in my hoodie. Benefits of having long hair, like that. We might be able to do, make this work. Um, I've got a bowl, very makeshift, and I'm just gonna wash it off in front of you so that you can see how it washes off. And a towel. So let's do this. Don't know why I'm doing this right now. I'll be annoyed if my hair goes in the water because I literally um, just dried it with a hairdryer and I never do that. Okay, let's go. You might not even be able to see what I'm doing because I'm low down. So, three swipes of water. It's very creamy. Very creamy. <laughs> That's what I would describe this product as. Creamy. So I'm just gonna rub it to get, try and kind of rub it off almost. This is what it's looking like. Okay. 
few more swipes of water or a few more washes of water again move it in the thing that i find with like moisturizing face masks is they are often a little bit more difficult to get off whereas clay masks for example my charcoal clay mask that i sell um on my etsy and ebay link in the description um wash off instantly like one sweep of water and it basically comes off you don't really have to rub it off um and i find that often with clay masks which is quite nice but yeah with moisturizing ones you do kind of have to work the product up a little bit more okay um i don't care if there's still some on me i'm gonna get a towel anyway yeah there's a little bit of orange on the towel sorry mom i'll show you the color of the water it's like um slightly orange and bubbly so let's talk about my final thoughts of this uh pumpkin face mask on the body shop so now my skin is feeling so soft like i think this would be the perfect face mask for um the morning time before you do your makeup because i like my skin to be so soft when i do my makeup and this makes your skin feel really really soft and like smooth and putting makeup onto smooth skin is like the best so i would recommend that in terms of like up close my skin is quite um i would say it does look quite glowy considering i literally just washed it off like there is still some glow there but i know from having used this a few times before that it does make my skin quite nice and glowy which i like overall in terms of this whole mask would i recommend it yes 100 if you don't like the smell of pumpkins or don't like pumpkins in general maybe not but if you do then this is great i love this i love the color of it i love the look of it i love how it applies i love how soft my skin feels afterwards and how you know glowy my skin looks afterwards i really like i love like having glowy skin in general so i am a really you know a really big fan of this face mask and i would recommend it especially if you've got dry skin this might be a product that you will enjoy so let me know if you buy this product or if you're going to buy this product and let me know in the comments your experience with it do you use it in the shower or don't you obviously i have made the conscious decision not to use it in the shower based on my own personal preference even though i have tried it in the shower i just kind of like the feeling of it kind of setting down for a little bit and also whenever i put a face mask on i am like the most productive i've ever been i'm like right i'm gonna get this 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 this, this done in that 10 minutes and then i'll wash my face mask off so i kind of like to use face masks out of the shower and yeah so please let me know if you do purchase the product let me know if there's any other products that you would like to hear my opinion of from the body shop or just in general but anyway thank you for watching give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you want to see more content on my channel i do weekly vlogs i do a youtube podcast with my mum and i also will be filming lots of other videos and body shop videos and the sun can you please go away um but yeah so uh thanks for watching see you then goodbye